All right, now question 10. We have negative 7 and 7 eighths divided by 3 over 2. The first step in this question is to write the mixed number as an improper fraction. So 8 times 7 is 56. That's 56 eighths, okay? And then plus 7, what does that give us? 6 and 7 is 3, and carry the 1, 63, right? So that gives us negative 63 eighths divided by and when you divide by a fraction you multiply by the reciprocal you multiply and then you flip the fraction on the right flip the fraction on the right multiplied by two-thirds okay and we can go ahead and multiply the tops and the bottoms but it would be even better if we did what if we cross cancel to begin with, right? So how about this? 2 into 2 goes once, 2 into 8 goes 4 times, right? How about the 3 into 63? How does that cross cancel? 3 into 3 goes once, 3 into 6 goes what? Just, just do it 3 into 6. What's 3 into 6? 3 into 6 is twice. And what's 3 into 3? 3 into 3 goes one time. See that? So that gives us negative 21 times 1, which is negative 21, over 4 times 1, 4, right? Now we put this as a mixed number. What's 4 into 21? 4 into 21 goes how many times? Well, 4 fives is 20, so 4 into 21 goes 5 times, and what's the remainder? The remainder is 1. So 5 and 1 quarter. And it's a negative number, isn't it? So negative 5 and 1 quarter is the answer. Yep.